What up guys, Jacques Slade here, back with another unboxing, and today I have something very special for you from the Dorn Becker Freestyle Collection for 2016. Uh, if you've been watching my past unboxing, you know I've already unboxed a couple of these, and this one has the best storytelling so far, and I'm really excited to show you this one and show you the details on this shoe, because they are crazy. So this shoe was designed by a kid named Andy Grass, and the way that Andy ended up at the Dorn Becker Freestyle, or at the Dorn Becker Hospital, was because he was in a very traumatic accident, and and uh, instead of me actually telling you that story, um, I'll let Andy tell you that story. So check this out. I like playing sports because I'm very competitive. I like baseball and basketball because all my friends play that. My name's Andy Grass and I'm 11 years old. It was Christmas Eve 2014. Andy was 10 years old when we were at the beach and he had jumped on a log uh, to get out of the way of, a, way of a sneaker wave, he fell off and the log uh, collapsed onto him. He sustained multiple life-threatening injuries, including two collapsed lungs, a broken cheekbone, broken pelvis, broken ankle, broken toes, and a lacerated liver. They had asked us, you know, what hospital do you want to go to? There are a couple trauma one centers for children and immediately you know, I said, I want to go to Dornbecker. It's almost indescribable how, you know, important it was for him to be there. I mean, we feel like they saved his life. I think my biggest worry was, you know, what's he going to be like when he wakes up? Is he going to be the same kid? As he was waking up, he couldn't talk because he had a tube down his throat. And I took a baseball and I put it in his hand and I asked him to show me his, his fastball grip. So he did. And then I asked him to show me his change-up grip, and he did. And then I asked him to show me his curveball grip, and he turned the ball to show me his grit. And it was right then that I knew that his head was okay, that everything was going to be all right. No matter how much it hurt, no matter how hard it was, he was going to get better, and he was going to do whatever it took to make that happen. And we asked him to do a lot of crazy things that he didn't want to do, but he never complained. He never said no. He just said, okay, if this is going to help me get better, I'm going to do it. Thank you for helping me recover, and I hope you can do it for every other kid that's injured or sick. Shout out to Andy and his family. So glad to hear that you're doing better, Andy. So now that we've heard Andy's story, let's actually look into his shoes. As you can see, the Dornbecker boxes are all coming in this like light blue, maybe Tiffany blue, if you want to call it that way. Has Dornbecker Freestyle right there on the top of the box. And then on the inside, it has some information about Andy. Uh, Freestyle Unstoppable, his name Andy Grass. His age is 11, the trauma and the shoe that he worked on, well, Let's check that out in here. Uh, obviously it comes with the same freestyle paper, the white paper with the freestyle and the metallic sort of gray silver colorway. The Dornbecker freestyle stickers. You know it'd be dope if they just had these stickers available. Uh, might be cool to like throw on your laptop or something like that, but that's not what this came with. Those are just here. And so here is the sneaker, the Kyrie 2. Uh, Kyrie actually wore these in a game. Here's a picture of Kyrie rocking these in the game. And not only did he wear them in the game, when he announced that he got a pair of the HyperAdapt 1.0s, he actually wore them in that video as well. Back to the shoes, so let's check this one out. Let's get them both out of the box here so you guys can get a better look at these. These are really cool. I really like what they did with these shoes. So, the box down here. So let's take a look at the shoes. So first off, you see the biggest thing and the most bold thing is grass strong. So when Andy was in the hospital, one of the parents that from his school made up the saying grass strong, which was something that his family used to help them get through the situation that they were in when Andy was in the hospital. Now the details on these are really what make this shoe super incredible. One of the most poignant and strongest parts of this shoe are right here on the Nike swoosh. Uh, here it says joy and this writing is actually in, in Andy's writing. So what happened was while Andy was in the hospital, his aunt had cancer. His aunt was in the hospital as well and she ended up dying from cancer or succumbing to cancer, I should say. Andy wrote joy and the Nike designers took the words joy and included them 
in the Nike swoosh right here on the lateral side of the shoe. And that's probably the dopest detail on this shoe, um, at least to me and in my opinion. And that's probably speaking from personal opinion because I had a mother who was affected by cancer. So just to see that is just really, really awesome. Um, as far as the major co color scheme on these shoes, you notice that there's a lot of blue and there's a lot of red and those go with Andy's, uh, his baseball and his basketball team. So that's where those colors come from. Kyrie was very involved with the design of these shoes or in, in part with these shoes. So you see it has a zero here and then that's, uh, that's actually Andy's number. And it's Kyrie, this is Kyrie's actual writing for the numbers. So Kyrie like submitted his own handwriting for those. And then the other details, if you actually take off the Velcro, you'll see it says, trust God. Obviously a big thing for his family. And then it says, never give up, which is one of Andy's personal sayings to never give up Andy's family. And then on the other shoe, they have some hidden details as well. And this one says, love, Mom, shout out to mom, always gotta give mom props. And again, it has never give up. So there's also some details here on the tongue of the shoe, which is probably the cooler of the details. And it's Andy with a baseball bat and a basketball, and he's actually standing on and squishing the log that actually crushed him. So you can see obviously metaphorically showing Andy and his recovery and that the log wasn't gonna stop him and now he's gotten better and he feels better about that in his life, which I think is very, very dope, very, very well done. And then there's also the lion logo here, which looks really dope actually. And it's a baseball bat, well two baseball bats and a basketball, which obviously uh, speak to Andy's love of basketball and his love of baseball as well. Um, so that's really the major details. There's a few more, like there's some stuff here on the eyelets, but I'm not going to tell you about that because I kind of want you guys to figure that out as on your own. And then there's some details on the liner, um, but I want you guys to kind of figure those out as well so that if you do get the shoes, you kind of look at those and you go, oh, that's what that was about or that's what that means. I don't want to give away all of the details on the shoe just because I just don't think that would be right to tell you everything. Actually, and there's one one more thing. Um, so when you get the shoes, check out the liner, check out the uh, the lace tips. But then there's one thing um, that you should know about. And this right here, it's KV, uh, which are the initials of the little his therapist from the Dornbecker Hospital that helped him get better, that helped him through the process of walking again and getting better. So the shoe overall was Andy's way of saying thank you to those at the Dornbecker Hospital that helped him. And you, as you can see he included a lot of stuff from his basketball team from his baseball team for his family and those at the hospital that helped him um, to get better and like he integrated all of those shoes all of those things into his design which I think makes it one of the better designs that we have seen so far these shoes are set to release uh, the Dornbecker collection will be available starting on December 17th and as you can see Andy put in work like the other shoes this was all based on Andy's design decisions. Big shout out to Kyrie for actually wearing these in the game and wearing these during practice and the warmups. I thought that was very dope of Kyrie. And the pair that Andy actually has of these are actually signed by Kyrie, which I think is a big deal as well. Anyway, so with that being said, you guys, um, as always, I wanna thank you for taking the time to watch this video. And if you have the opportunity to, why don't you go ahead and do donate to the Dornbecker Hospital. It's obviously a great cause uh, that they're helping people. Or um, make sure you pick these up because the proceeds from the Dornbecker collection go to the hospital as well. With that being said, I'm Jacques Slade. This is another unboxing from the Dornbecker Freestyle 2016 collection. As always, guys, I appreciate you, and I'll see you soon. Peace. Three. What if we...
What if we double up? Would you both? You both do that because you're willing that you get it. Oh my gosh. Wait a minute. We can't. 34? Huh? Oh, I can't. I, well, now I gotta go back. I don't know. This is putting a big strain on people that we don't. This is an Eastern Bat Company. We don't control these people. Here's the thing. I don't, we, there's a lot of stuff going on here, like his whole team and things like that. So, what are we? I mean, we've never had. Obviously, we've never had this situation. <laughs> I got the word from somebody who has no authority that yes, <laughs> yes, we can do three at 33. Thank you.